Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. I greet you once again, hoping that it has been well with you. And right now, I want to go back with you in the kitchen. Most of you keep wondering why Luyas has been the only tribe in the world that has produced the best rugby players in the world. I want to give you the reason by requesting you to accompany me in a very simple kitchen where we make a very simple strong meal that you need just to take once per day and you stay strong in the field of rugby, healthy and sound in mind as well. So don't worry, the name of the meal in itself is called Eshitata. I know the lawyers who know Eshitata, they are smiling wherever they are. Welcome, let me take you through the kitchen. First of all, the requirements for you to be able to make the starter are very simple. You need maize flour, we call it unga in Swahili, and the most recommendable unga we need in this case is the jogo maize flour. The reason why we recommend jogo maize flour is because it has got 75% of its content being the starch, and we have vitamin A, vitamin B, we have zinc, and other elements that you need for the sake of your health and well-being balanced diet. In itself, it is a stable maize meal. Number two, the reason why we recommend the jogo maize flour is because it is white as compared to other maize flours. You know, that is a thing. The reason why we want the one that is white is because if you take the other preferred or alternative maize flours, you will realize that when you mix it with ripe banana in the process of Uganda, you will realize that it will darken up. And so when you serve the guest with a meal that is dark, in a color kind of like you realize that in as much as it may be sweet but it is not attractive to the eye the attention of something is what also helps to build up the appetite of those people who are eating it so therefore i recommend you to take the jogo maize flour this is what we take in western and i'm telling you <laughs> we have it here. The second requirement for us to be able to make the shtata, which I would otherwise call in a simple language the, uh, uh, the luya cake. That is, yeah, we need uh, the banana. There is a type of banana we call the risotti. <laughs> These names you cannot find them in English. You only find them in the luya language. I'm telling you, luyas, we are like the Chinese people. He, hi, he, and you can never find them. Even when it comes to the sorcery, we have names of diseases and some sort of witchcraft you can never find in English. Efehoho, Obusula, Obuindi, Obuima, and a lot of things. You, you get it? So, not unless you come to our school. However, the alternative the, uh, banana can as well serve the purpose, yes, but how we recommend the result. And it must be ripe. The banana in itself, it has got the elements of carbohydrates. We have the protein, though in a small content, but of course it is still important. We have the fiber, which helps you or prevents you from constipation, and uh, 110 elements of uh, calories. So you realize that we are dealing with a balanced diet, which if you get served just a simple meal of eat in a day you are good uh, uh, to go yes and again you also need sugar because sugar in itself is a preservative so being a preservative it simply means that uh, the meal we want to make as at this time it is something that can last for three to four five days without any complication in as much as you keep it away from anything to do with the steam or moist areas it will still be a stable meal that's why we need this so far we will need uh, the nylon pepper bags, the ones we use to package sugar in our shops. Of course, the purpose for this is because the meal we want to make, it is cooked through a form of cooking we call steaming. Traditionally, in our culture, we don't use this. We instead use the banana fibers. But the challenge with the banana fibers is because uh, uh, they create the, the loopholes through which the water gets through your estata and to some extent uh, it affects it in, in a way. So far, the best way to protect your estata from the water 100% during cooking and you ensure that it is cooked through what we call steaming is when you use these uh, nylon paper bags. You will need water. Here we have the water in a jug and so ladies and gentlemen, I welcome you in my simple kitchen so that I can take you through the process of Eshitata preparation, the one you need to be able to stay strong as a rugby player.
Now, ladies and gentlemen, let me take you through the process. And here, the process begins. Open up your maize flour, of course, from Jogo Maize Millers. And, you know, just a good content of it. Pour it on your basin, depending on the size of your family or the size of the family you have. If you happen to get the sulfur, that is Doremi Fasolatido family, then at the end of the day, you'll need to use a lot of unga. But as for me, I'm making it for a family of, uh, you know, uh, 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 six people of which will call me to use, uh, to use uh, just but half. That is one kilogram of uh, jogo maize flour. Thereafter, I've did, or maybe I can add a little bit of it. That is so far. Then you can take your bananas and uh, mix them up over there. You therefore have to ensure that uh, the ratio in relation to the mixing between the unga or the flour, it should get ripe banana being a little bit uh, higher in content as compared to your flour. This is how it looks on our plate. Therefore, take a bit of sugar. Then you start your mixing up. Of course, you have to ensure that uh, your hands are clean. In this case, you don't need water here. Water must not be added here. If you add water here, then you shall have created steam inside of your content. So far, it will still be a meal, yes, but it's not something you can preserve. It will start stinking with the time. You get me? Then let us start the process. The only water you use, it is of course the water in the ripe banana. Start your mixing, start your mixing. That's how you do it. That's how the process goes. Keep mixing it, ladies and gentlemen. Keep mixing it. You see, it is responding. You might think that we put some water when in real sense there is no water we used. And of course, that's why I said the content of the ripe banana must be a little bit greater as compared to that of the maize flour that uh, you could be using. It's a simple kitchen that will get to transform your life as far as the matters of the stomach are concerned. Ladies and gentlemen, well, we call it the eshtata. 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 I'm telling you, you will feel so good. Look at this, ladies and gentlemen. You thought that we put water. There is no water we put here. <laughs> I'm telling you, this is what we eat. That's why we stay strong. That's why we have healthy marriages, very healthy children. Ebony and Bia, Nuatu Kungina, Pan, Nairobi, Napata, too, Mutu, and Kanyaga by Skelia, Boda Boda, Mebeba, Mama Muzito, and a Peter Nequa Bamp, and a Speedy Kojuna, a Jokin, a Kogamalima, and a Panda. Then you expect that you can compare with yourself with us when we are playing rugby. No, come to our kitchen. Hmm? Behind a successful man, there is a process. <laughs> Behind a healthy man, there is a process. And the process is in our kitchen. Make sure you mix it to the extent that uh, no one can get to spot some elements of uh, banana as of this kind. This is just but a mixture of the maize flour and a ripe banana. Therefore, welcome. Put it on your table. Spread it out on the table with your roller. Again, it doesn't have to be as thin as that of the chapati, you know. <laughs> this has to be a little bit thicker, but not too much thick. Because when you make it too much thick again, you'll realize that uh, it will uh, take too much time during cooking. Look at what I'm doing. Now this one, I put it aside. Look at what I'm doing. What I'm doing. You cut it through like that. Take this away. Take this away. Put it in the nylon bag. Make sure there is no air. Then you close. So get quite a number of peppers. Now it becomes a quicker process when you look at it it has a little it has turned a little bit darker now you understand the reason why i told you the best maize flour you need to use is jogo it is jogo 
because Jogo has very white flour. You might use the shape you want, but the reason we cut it into such pieces is so that uh, we ensure that uh, they are a little bit presentable, you know, and attractive to the consumers. This is how we survived uh, in 1994 to 1996. During that type of uh, hunger, we used to call Savalala, and in now Amaramoja. It is simply translated into one meal a day. So we take this, we stay strong, we stay healthy, and we are not affected by the economy so far. Let me tell you, ladies and gentlemen, the best way you can make a man happy, it is not when you buy him a car. No, he will still leave you together with that car and go and get another woman. However, less beautiful or ugly she might be, yes, of course, but in as much as she knows how to cook. So the only way you can be able to touch the heart of a man is when you make a meal he can appreciate. Now this one, I'm going to appreciate if you want to mingi, manyama mingi. Just give us something that is strong. I was in China. I had gone to make this in a wedding of a friend of mine. And I'm telling you, the Chinese left the snacks and the frogs and they came and ate the shitata and they praised me a whole day. Wow, wow, wow. Thank you so much, ladies and gentlemen. Here we are. Let me take you now through the process of cooking. Wow, thank you ladies and gentlemen. Now it is cooking. Once it starts boiling, give it a while of at least 30 and at most 45 minutes. And I'm telling you, you'll have come out with the best meal. Now, for a while of time, let us be patient and wait for our starter to cook before I serve you on the table. Wow, ladies and gentlemen, like I had told you that I will get back to you after for five minutes so that now we confirm whether our extra meal is ready to be served or not. Now, you put up the lid. When you take it out of this place and start taking it out of the nylon, you will get burnt. So, you pour cold water on it. But this cold water will not make it cold. It will remain warm for the ease of uncovering it of, you know, from the nylon bags. Check them out. This is the kind of cooking we call steaming. You see? Now, here we are. Now, you get to the next process that involves getting the out of. You see? It's a very good meal. Nice stuff. Put it in your plate. Ready to be served. And maybe you are asking, you have kept it for like two days and you still want to take it. Do you take it when it is cold? No. Just take it as it is, put it in an nylon bag again, put it back in the hot water, boil it for a while of five minutes and serve your guests. The same process repeats itself. Thank you ladies and gentlemen. Our shtata is ready to be served. And like I had told you, you can serve it with either a glass of milk or let me serve my wife here together with my daughter or you can as well serve your guests, friends and also it is always display that before you take a meal you give thanks yes my daughter we give thanks now come on it's all right thank you let's give thanks we thank you father in the name of jesus for the provision we pray that it's of health and strength to our bodies we receive it with thanksgiving in jesus name Amen. Amen. You're welcome, my wife. Thank God bless you. Thank Maybe to start with, uh, do I take off this? No, I'll, you will still assume that I'm still a kitchen man. How do you feel? Mm. 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 
Come on. Come on. Come on. Nice place. That is what I told you. That is what I told you. Welcome to Western, where we make reasonable meals. Only but for the rugby players. Shalom. Check it, man. Feel good? Ah, feel it good? Well, um, God bless you. <laughs>